people by being angry and thinking they know what they want, thinking of themselves they could do nothing. They play God. And as long as you play God, the devil is your daddy and not God. So you repent. The oh, repent for not- playing God. Gotcha, and most gotcha. people don't realize that. Okay. Uh, last que- I got one more question for you. Uh, what color is Jesus Christ? My God is no color. He's not a color. He's a spirit, but not a color. Oh. <laughs> Hey, okay. Hey, yeah, we got, we, we, we got, we got, got a mighty chest. man that want to give you a, hey, a, a, a. What's happening, y'all? There you go. Hello. There you go. We got the oh, mighty. Zeke and Abiel. Welcome. 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 Good morning, Abiel. sir. Good morning, sir. You have hey, any question for? You got any question for Mister Peterson? Yeah, I got. I got a question. Can we read uh, John seven thirty eight? Mm-hmm. John chapter seven verse thirty eight. I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm like the uh, the listeners today. I want to get. I want to get straight to that coon shit he be talking, y'all. I'm just going to be 100% <laughs> honest with y'all. But we gonna, I know y'all building it up. Facts. I know we building up to it. All praises. But let's read John oh, oh. 7, 38 real quick. John, John 7, chapter 7, verse 38. He that as believeth as on me, as the scripture hath said, Jesus. out of his belly hey, shall so, flow so, rivers so, of so, living so, water. Hold on. Hold on. Wait a minute. Deke, Deke, say that again. Deke. Ask Jesse. If he believes this scripture right here, you read, you read. Oh, okay. uh, go back to Elisha. I need you to pay attention. Go back to we have to ask uh, Jesse Lee question. So, Mr. Peterson, the question is, do you believe the scripture we're about to read right here? Go ahead, Cap. Read it. John 7, 38. He that believeth on me, as the scripture had said, out of his belly shall flow rivers of living water. Mr. Peter, I absolutely believe that. As the scripture said, those who believe in God, that will happen. But most people, 99.9% of people do not believe in God. They believe in the Bible. And if you notice, they are not getting any better. They're very insecure. They have anger. Let me ask, do you have anger? I do. I yeah, do. I do too. Hell yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, Hell yeah, I got anger. What do you mean? <laughs> we at the bottom. Anger, righteous anger. <laughs> Did you know that any male that has anger in a woman, you're a female? Huh? Let's read that in the Bible. Wait a minute. Wait, wait. Because wait. anger is not of it's it's not of God, and it's not natural for men to have anger. They became that way when they were traumatized by their mothers or grandmothers. Because you become like whomever made you angry, you take on their identity. It's not natural for a man to be angry. That's why when men and women come together, you have two females together fighting one another, and the man is incapable of leading the woman out of the hell that she's in because he has the same nature that she has. He has his mother's nature. But when you forgive your mother, God will change that name. He would take that spirit away from you, which is of the devil, by the way, and return you back to God. So any male that has anger as a female. That's why black men act like black women. They're angry, they're out of control, they're emotional, they're up and down, they're just like their mothers. And, and the women, can they hate men like that. They love hate, they love control you when you're weak like that, but they hate controlling you because they need, a, they need men to be strong in order to, of God to bring them out of the hell that they're in. Okay. <laughs> can we read Exodus 32, please? Yeah. Exodus 32 and 10. So any male that has anger is a female. <laughs> is, is that in the Bible, Jesse? Yes. Where? Oh, Lord, help me. Uh, during the Adam and Eve syndrome, where... Um, what scripture can we go to, Jesse? To read let, me, let me change this first. Adam, Adam, prior to Eve, had a relationship with his father, God. They, they, they communicated without words. They, he loved his father. His father loved him. Then at some point, God created the woman, Eve. And at first, Eve loved her husband who loved his father. All was well. Long story short, the serpent, the deceiver, Satan came along. And he said to the woman, you don't have to listen to that man. You could be your own woman. You could be a, a feminist. You could be independent. You're equal to the man. At first, she said no. But at some point, the devil kept tempted her. Eventually, she said yes to it. And when she said yes, she no longer obeyed her husband because Satan became her daddy. And she could no longer believe her husband. She couldn't believe the husband who believed the father. And so after a while, long story short, she were able to 
says, Adam, don't listen to your father. He doesn't know what he's talking about. He's trying to control you. And so at some point, the man believed the woman. Adam believed the woman. And so the woman became his God. And today, unless you're born of the father, the woman is your God. And that's why you don't know how to deal with the hell in her. And Satan is the woman's God. And, and it's been passed down from generation to generation, gener- generation, and it's coming through the mother. And the fathers do not understand how to understand, how to okay. deal with it because they have not been born of the father. So they end up bailing out, leaving their children with the mother. Or even if they stay, they become the boy and the wife become the mother. And the mother still end up destroying the children. Hey, you know, you know what though? Can I say this real quick, Deacon? I'll be honest. We sorry. didn't. We went all the way in just in, imagination. There you go. I asked for a scripture. There you one. go. There you hey, go. Deacon, you know what though? He Jesse Lee is no different than any other Christian pastor. That's it. To be honest, because the Bible is there, and they'll believe in certain tenets, but they really don't believe the Bible. Right. right. That's why you'll go into Christianity, and you'll hear so much in that church. But when you read the Bible, it's not there. Yeah, it's not, yeah. right, it's right. not there. So the only thing is, Jesse Lee is just voicing it openly. Right. He's telling right. you, I don't believe in the Bible. Straight up. Pastors will hold the Bible and lie to you like they believe what the right. word of God says. Right. Hey, hey, De- Deacon Abiel, if I may, can we get that, brothers? First Peters 4 and 11. We're going to go straight to it. Mm-hmm. Hey, hey, let me ask you a question. Mm-hmm. Mr. Peterson, my name is Captain Aria. Where did you go to get your pastoral theology degree. theology degree i went nowhere i then uh, the father I, if god is truly caught uh, if god is truly using you to bring a message forward no man can tell you what god gonna have you to say or do no human being could prepare you and tell you what god will have you we have a teacher within okay which is the holy spirit and he would teach you all things okay. of god within us we have Christ, his son, Christ within us, and we have the Holy Spirit. No school, no human being can tell you what the Father would tell you and have you to do. Okay. So, so Cap- Captain uh, Aurier, that, in other that, words. That includes Christ. In other words, like we mentioned earlier, he's winging it. He's winging it. He's <laughs> <All right>. winging it. <laughs> let's, let's see what the God of the Bible says, the black Messiah. Read what you got. First Peter chapter Look how many black people 11. believe hold on, hold on, in the hold on, Bible. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You're doing that. Let me just make this point. Jesse, 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 you be a messy. Hold on, hold on a Jesse, you be a messy. Let me, let me just say Read this. what you got. First no, Peter chapter on, 4, on, verse 11. Read if any man speak, let him speak as the oracles of God. Read. If any man minister, let him do it as of the ability which God gave it. Wait a minute, because you just made the statement, well, the Holy Ghost and the Holy Spirit gave me, but you're not using the Holy Spirit. You're not using what God said. It said, if any man speak, let him speak as it is written. That is what the Bible is saying right here. You coming off the heart. You coming off what Satan gave you. Your father gave you. You're not speaking according to what God said. So if you're going to speak, if you're going to speak, you got to speak as it is written because you're quoting it. So you got to speak it as it's written. One last scripture, Ecclesiastes 7. No, let, let him speak now. Let him speak. Go ahead, Jesse. Go ahead. That's because you guys don't know what the heart is. You don't realize when I'm speaking of the heart, I'm talking about the soul of God. We are created in his image, and we have his soul, his spirit in us. But due to the anger, we have been separated. What is the, what is the spirit? We have been separated from that by being blind and, and, and unable to see. So when I speak of the heart, you think I'm talking about the mind, I guess. It's not like you think I'm talking about the mind. And I'm not talking about the mind. I'm talking about the heart, the soul of the heart, which is of God. The, the heart the that just pumps, heart. pumps, pumps blood. blood. Just pumps blood. I'm not talking about that at all. Okay, so explain. Jeremiah 17:9. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Let, yeah. You guys are just a bunch of Bible thumpers. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, just, yeah. You don't thump the Bible at all. There you go. And y'all, and y'all stop it too much. You're blind and can't see. <laughs> well, blo- can I, well, can I ask so. A Mr. Jesse, this is Iona again. I have a question for you. Okay. Okay. So you just said that man, we are made in the image of God, correct? Men are. Uh, okay. And okay. the woman no, no. is made in the image of the man. Okay. I, I agree with Where'd that. Where did you get that from, though? <laughs> because it says. Okay. So, but when you were asked earlier what was color, you said God was invisible. 
So I'm in my I mind. I said that God is the spirit. He's not invisible. Okay, so. He's invisible to the blind, those who have anger. Okay, so if God is invisible, how are we made in his image? Well, men are made in his image spiritually. What, what image? They have his spirit. They have his identity, right? And then the woman came from the man. So the woman is made in the man's image. And if you notice, it, what's your name again? I'm sorry. Iona. Iona, do you agree with me that women were not created to lead, but to follow? I absolutely agree. But how, hold on. I, I, okay. So I'm going to use my father, my biological father. I'm made in the image of my father. I look exactly like my dad, right? Right. When you see me, I'm the female version of him. So if men are made in the image of God, not if mm. I'm, I'm saying for him. Okay. Mm. okay men, men are made in the image of God. I, I'm not computing what you're saying. In other words, what she's saying is that flesh. What does that flesh look like? Your flesh, apparently your flesh look like the image of your father. And so when people see her, they see the image of her father in a physical way, right? But men are created in the image of God spiritually. We are not our body. So we it's live not in a body. We live in a body, but we are not our body. Okay, we are so, a spirit so, that lives uh, in the body. Jeremiah okay. 17 and 9. Bring Let's it read the scripture. <laughs> Can we get Daniel 10 also? Right, in Ecclesiastes yeah. 7 to 7. Jeremiah 17 and 9. So many places I want to go. Go ahead. <laughs> Jeremiah chapter 17, verse 9. The heart is deceitful above all things. Right now, Mr. Peterson, this is talking about you. Yeah. Your heart is deceitful above all things. Read. And desperately wicked. Your heart is desperately wicked. Because, you know, you know I don't want to flip the subject. But my next question was going to be to you is this. Who's, resp who's, who's, be, who's responsible when you look at the black community, when you look at us as a people? I'm talking about as a people. I'm not talking about individual. Because mm -hmm. we are a people. We are a nation of people. We are the mm -hmm. sons and daughters of God. We right. are the Israelite. Right. When you look at us as a people, who's responsible for the demise of our people? Um, number one, our parents, when we were young, uh, if they fail for the lie and put another human being over them, then they are responsible. But as adults, we are responsible. Each individual adult is responsible for each individual. No one else is responsible for anything for the adult. You are in charge of your own life. And anyone who blames someone else for what's happening in their life, they're losers. They're weak. They cannot see. And so, so we, as each individual adults, oh, are responsible for what happens in our lives. Did slavery happen? Slavery happened. Mm -hmm. and okay. Yes, it did happen. So who was in slavery? What do you mean? Who were enslaved what? in America? No, no, no. no. Whose slavery happened to? In America, it happened to blacks. It happened to, apparently, Japanese were in, in camp <laughs> at one time. And, so and, slavery and, happened in America to the Japanese? No, apparently, were they in, in some type of encampment at one nope, point? No, nope, no, it did nope. not. No, it they were in not. concentration they camps. They, 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 they went something to like that did happen. Hey. But blacks were enslaved, and there were black people who owned slaves as well in America. There we go. So, I knew it was coming. So, you agree slavery happened to black people in America, right? Yes. Okay, who was their slave master? There were whites and blacks, slave masters. Was that a majority so black funny. slave masters? Well, there's that, majority or was that or not. Or, or, or? No, it wasn't majority because white people were at that time majority in America. So it wasn't majority, but there were black people who owned slaves as well. He's talking about servants. Servants. Yeah. But go ahead, Cam. I'm not talking about servants. Don't put words in my mouth. I said slave owners. So slave owners was white <laughs> and black. I, I don't, I, We're not talking about the black slave owners. We're talking about white slave owners. Was there was the majority of them white slave owners? Yes or no? Right, because they were mostly white people in America at the time. Amazing. 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 <sighs> Amazing. So he doesn't believe what in the Bible. The... 
Uh, but he doesn't believe in the does Bible. Deacon, Deacon, Deacon Abiel, Deacon is there Abiel. anything you like to bring forth? Deacon Abiel. <sighs> hey, let me tell y'all something, bro. Y'all went and found the grandest cracker of all niggas in the world. <laughs> <laughs> Look, it's, it's no, I even have the Cooter Ward. The Cooter Ward? You got the Cooter yeah. Ward. Damn! I'm a fall hey, out hey, the hey, somebody tried. He's hey, hey. Deacon, this is a plantation celebration award. Now, you know you can't get any better than that. <laughs> hey, at, le at least he knows He's it. Proud He's it, proud though. of He's it, proud too. Of it. Hey, oh, hey can I, do you know who the Great White Hope is? You. Uh, you the Great White Hope. And yes, together, we will make America great again. <laughs> <laughs> the great white hope. That was Trump. Trumpy. Oh, good. Can you hey. see it? Hey, listen, Late. do we have hey. another, another Zoom call? Can you see it? Oh. He's... Okay, Deacon Abio, go ahead. Deacon I hey, call us, Deacon I I got a question for Jesse. Do you see the great white hope first? He is great. Uh, yeah, oh, we, we see your great white hope. Hey, look at right. Jesse. Did you know? Somebody sent me a black the, Jesus. Hold on. He, Jesus is black. But listen, did you know, according to the Bible, God hates the whole Caucasian race? Did you know that? Amazing. No, I didn't. You didn't God know that? Huh? God doesn't have hate in him. Oh, come on. Please come pull on. It out. Come on, Jesse. Please Romans 9, please. Give me Romans 9, oh, 13. Bring it out. For the, for the coolest of all coons. Do you love white people? Brand master cool. I knew Let, me ask you. Yeah. Let me ask you, do you love white people? Yeah. Give me that. Romans 9, 13. Romans chapter 9, verse 13. Why are you 13. looking for that? As you love white people? Jacob have I loved, but Esau have I hated. Now, Jesse, do you believe in that part of the Bible? Because we know you pick and choose. I'm asking you, do you love white people? No, sir. You don't love white people? I, no. I'm too busy loving my nation. That's right. That's, That's right. right. So how can you love a nation but not love all people? Mm -hmm. What do you mean how? I'm asking how is that possible? I'm too busy loving my nation. My nation needs all How is it that you can love? All my, listen, all my energy and my attention is going into rebuilding of my nation, similar to how Moabites do, or I'm sorry, Asians do, similar to how white people do. All my love and attention goes to the building of my nation, building back my people, bringing my people back how, to God. But how are you able to love your quote-unquote nation but not love white people? Easy. I love my nation. I, I'm too busy loving my nation. Hmm. So did God send his son just for your nation? Yeah. Or Absolutely. did he send his son for all? There we go. Absolutely. Listen, I know you're trying to walk into it, Jesse. Let's deal with this first. And we go deal with John 3.16. Yeah. But we got to do Romans I'm trying to walk into what? Say God ate it. Jesse, is that true? God I don't said know. he saw. I don't know what that means at all. But I do know that God does not hate God love. And because so, of his love, he sent his you're son. You're not the Bible is what you're saying. You can't, you can't understand or register the words that we just read. Read it again, but just maybe he didn't. Understand. As it is written, Jacob have I loved, but Esau have I hated. You're on, Jesse. I don't know what that means at all. Whoa. Damn! <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. A, it, don't, it don't register, Deacon. I'll be so that, Who is, so who is Esau? That's what it's going to ask. Does he know who Esau is? Who is okay. Esau? In your mind, in, your, in you guys' mind, who is Esau? According to the Bible, Esau is the so-called Caucasian, the so-called white man. In the and the Earth. Bible said that Esau was white? Absolutely. Yep. So in the Bible, it says... No, he's in the Bible, Wait a minute. We commonly say white. I, I need to ask you a question. He's red. He's a red man. So in the Bible, does it say Esau is white? No, no, no. We say so how white. did you? Oh, you said rough, white. But he is technically red, and it does so, tell you so, he's red. So the Bible doesn't say Esau is white. You say he's white. No, no, no. I say he's red. Just say white so you can understand who I'm But how did you come up with white from red? Okay. Because you can see the blood through their skin. <sighs> red neck. We call them Peckwoods Woods down here in Oklahoma because <laughs> and they named them because they got a... They got red necks. Like hey, so, are uh, you so you're literally saying that according to you and you guys that Esau was red and out of red you guys came up with white. That's what the Bible says. <laughs> Amazing. Amazing. 
Hey. Oh, no. hey, oh we got Deacon yeah, Night Thong. We also have Deacon Night Thong. Deacon Night Thong. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, I'm, I'm I'm afraid and confused at this point. Um, I don't know how y'all got this far. I want to commend y'all for this. But give me Surat, give me Surat 33 and 5 real quick. Oh, man. Yeah, this is what's happening. This is happening. Oh, man. The Book of Surat, chapter 33 and verse right. 5. Yeah. The heart of the foolish is like a cartwheel, and his thoughts are like a rolling axle tree. <laughs> Damn! <laughs> We're going in circles. This guy goes in circles. There's no Bible. He's quoting the Bible. Doesn't believe in the Bible. This is right. insane. The, the, the axle tree is the bar that connects the wheels right. of a cart. Right. So right. that goes, that spins around. So, so you guys mentioned a hamster wheel earlier. A hamster wheel <laughs> earlier. That's what this is. We're going in a vicious circle, which is creating a vicious cycle of confusion. Yep. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm really, this is this is terrifying. This, this is a Christian it's, church. Yeah, it's a Christian. Yeah. Christianity yeah. is yeah. devastating to our hey, people. Hey, man. Hey, Deacon, be so, Jesse, you was on point, Jesse. You was on point earlier. You was on right, point. Right. But then you fell off the horse, man. Oh, you fell hey. out the horse. He fell off the mule. Hey, hey, Deacon, 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 and what's scary is. People mm-hmm. are sitting in his church listening to him. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Scary. That's some yeah. scary yeah. stuff yeah. right there with yes. no Bible. Mm. Like ta da. Yeah. 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 Ta da. So, no Bible. What so, is? Let me ask. Your name is Ethan or something? What do you say? Your name is? Ethan. 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 Do you love white people? Do I love white people? Do you love white people? <laughs> I don't love white people. I mean, I don't. I need I don't, to. See, I can't I, see him right now. I never met. All white people to love all white people. I, 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 I do love you them. love white people? Do I love them? Do you love white people? N- no, they exist. I don't love. I don't love. I don't love insects and bugs and stuff. I don't. You know, they're people. They're so people. Do you, I asked, do you love white people? I answered you. Yeah, I no, said, you yes, no, I don't love white people, but I, I acknowledge them. They're around. They exist. everyone exists. And and do you have anger as well? Anger in terms of what? What do you mean? Do you have anger? You mean like if I if I fall hit my, hit my toe? What do you mean? If I, if I don't get paid? Hey, do do you have anger? Uh, it depends on the situation, um, Jesse. Every person has anger. Do you, have anger? you have anger? Do I have anger like a human being does? Do yes, you do you uh-huh. have anger? Yes, I have anger, Jesse. <laughs> You do too. You have anger right now. You're just suppressing it. Uh, amazing. Amazing. Right. You know, I understand. I know for sure that you never should try to convince a Bible thumper that they're wrong or try to convince them or point the right way for them because they cannot see. You just have, you just have to leave them alone in their intellect and let them suffer. And hopefully one day in their suffering, they will cry out to the Father, the Father will guide them. You can't convince a Bible thumper that he or she is wrong. And this Jesse, is a, does this God is have anger? No. If I read it in the Bible, will you believe it? Will you retract your statement? No. I, I already seen that in the Bible. God has, God has discernment. He doesn't have that fallen state of anger that human nature have. Because the human nature is not of God. The human nature is of the devil. And they have the devil's anger. God has love, Satan has anger, but if you've identified with that, you believe it, God uh, has the same anger. God tell us to discern. No, he just, doesn't tell us to, to just, hate one hey, another. God, Every time you read oh. something in the scriptures, you notice what you do is you reject it. Mm-hmm. So you are correct. I believe you now. You don't believe in the Bible. You're just no, I don't believe in the Bible. God. I believe in God. When yeah. I was like, you guys, I used to... Did we ever read that? Read what? Did we ever read Jeremiah 17 and 9 for Jesse? Um, yes, we did. Yes, we did. did we? So, yes, we did. you understand this stuff that's going on in your mind mm-hmm. is desperately wicked. It's evil, Jesse. It's not of God. All it's minds Jeremiah. are evil. All thoughts are evil. There's not one true thought that is not evil. All thoughts are evil. But let me ask, do you have a leader? Yes, we do. Do you have a leader? I, yes, I do. And who is your leader? I follow Christ. Oh, Christ, Christ is your leader? The Lord and Savior is my leader. So do you I, have I, a physical leader? 
You talking about who I follow here? Yeah. Do I'm you following. have a physical leader? I have leaders. Do you have a physical leader? <laughs> he said yes, he has leaders. I have leaders. And, and and who is your physical leader? So let me break down the uh, the order for you real quick, because I follow the Most High God, His Son Jesus the Christ. I got the Bishop Nathaniel here on Earth. That's I right. I follow him. That follows Christ. I follow Bishop Yawasa. I follow Bishop Kenai. I follow Deacon Asaph. I follow Deacon Ithun. I got leaders, bro. Who is your physical leader? He just he just he just told you. He just told you. Amazing. <laughs> amazing, Jesse. Oh, Jesse, you amazing. Amazing. Hey, Who is hey. your physical leader? Hey, Mr. Peterson, I think this is why we got to block things out. So he he just do. told you. He just he told you. Is you are you not in He Christ? named off a whole bunch of stuff. I want to know who is his physical leader. He just told he you. He just told you. Jesse, he Jesse, Jesse you he amazing, Jesse. He told me a whole bunch of stuff. I no, asked no, no. who he is meant, his let physical me repeat, leader. Mr. Peterson, let me repeat what he said. I asked him where he's going. He told me where he's been. Peterson, he said... His physical Let him leader. speak for himself, mama. Let him speak for himself. Wait, wait. Who is your physical leader? I just answered your question. Who is hey, your give physical me the leader? Point. I'm about to fix what this whole just, thing. Oh. Hey, mute his mic. Mute his mic. Mute his oh, mic. what did you just say? <laughs> <laughs> hey, give me second Ezra. Uh, what's that? One? I think it's like, what, the last two what chapters? Did say? What, what did you just say? He's this the last two verses. Very uh, disrespectful. Deacon? Last two verses. Second Ezra chapter 1 and the last two verses. Verse 57. Who became servants? Oh, excuse me. Second Ezra. Second Ezra. Chapter 1, verse 38. Read that. And now, brother, behold what glory and see the people that cometh from the east unto whom I will give for leaders uh -oh. Abraham, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, Osias, Amos, and Micaiah, Joel, Atheus, and Jonas. <laughs> Nahum and Habakkuk, Sophonias, Agias, Zachary, and Malachi, which is called also an angel of the Lord. There go my leaders right there, bro. There go my leaders right there, man. Let me ask you this. Uh, do you love the Jews? We are the Jews. Yeah, we love our We people. are the Jews. Do you love the real Jews, the true Jews? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. No, no, no. Jesse. Hey, you know what I just noticed? Jesse looked on, Jesse bro. looked up, looked off screen like, yeah, I got him with this one. Uh, <laughs> no, I mean, so we 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 I'm asking you, we the real we, the we understand you. you're you're in Hollywood, so you know you have to be right. Hollywood, I guess. Do you love the truth? Jesse. No, 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 no. I need to get my question answered. You oh, love the true Jews, oh, not the fake Jews. Hold up. Hold up. Hey, listen, Captain Shabai, what you said is very imperative. Yeah. And I'm going to be honest with you. You're a smart man, Jesse. You, you definitely know over the years I've seen how you know how to get the clicks. You know how to get the views. Mm -hmm. You know how to get the people around. No, I'm black up. and slow, man. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. I'm black and slow. And listen, it's listen. True. It's true. Because of that, you've built a platform. I'm sure YouTube is paying you. You get money everywhere. But I'm going to tell you something. No. Realistically, Jesse, you're going to have to pay for every idle word that came out of right. your mouth. Yep. That's right. You didn't answer my question about word, loving the Jews. You guys are trying to I'm skip over that. Question. I know the money is good right now. But Do you love the Jews? We're going to answer your question. Hold on. Hold on. Hey, give me Revelation 29. I'm going to answer your question. I answer your question. I'm going to answer your question. Give me Revelation 29. Revelation why chapter that two guy, Why that guy can't no, answer the I'm question? Gonna, I'm going to answer your question. <laughs> He ran you, from that you question. Ask, you ask a question, right? But why are you speaking for him, I'm Mama? Speaking, let, let no, 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 no. You're not. I'm not speaking for him. <laughs> yes, you, you are. You, I didn't ask you the question, Mama. Mama, <laughs> I didn't ask you the question. <laughs> my name is Malachi. Let him. Let no, him speak for himself, is, Mama. My name, is, my name is Malachi. Give me Revelation chapter two. Malachi, let Revelation him speak Revelation chapter two, himself. verse nine. I know thy works and tribulation and poverty, <laughs> but thou art rich, and I know the blasphemy of them which say they are Jews and are not, but are the synagogue of Satan. The people over there in Israel today, they are the, they are the devil the Bible speak of. That's they right. are not the true Jews. We are the true Jews. That's, That's right. answer your question? And so if you, so let me ask the Jews who you think are not Jews, do they you love not. them? Do you love the Jews who you think are not the true Jews? Do you love them? I'm too busy loving the real Jews. Do you love the Jews, Jews that you believe are not the real Jews? I just Do you love a question. Them? No, I don't love them because I'm too busy loving the real Jews, which is my people. That's right. That's right. Amazing.
Amazing. Amazing, Jesse. Ain't it? Hey, I'm sorry. Can, can I? Can I? Can I? Can I get can one get quick? I, I got like seven yeah. teams. Why that, do you always beat for him? Are you afraid of what he might say, Mama? That's that's, that's Malachi. <laughs> He's Malachi, trying, I, I, why I, I, you play is, mama with him? The name is Malachi. Oh, oh, oh. Just he's disrespectful, man. He's I know, I know he's very disrespectful. I know, very disrespectful. Listen, I know he's very he trying to get a rise out of you, D. He tried to get a rise out of me. He ain't, ain't going to end. He ain't going to get that. Psalms 139. He ain't going to get that. I want Hey, I ain't calling no man mama. I don't know where to see. Because he kept speaking for you because you were unable to answer for yourself. Yeah, it's all, it's, it's all right. We understand, We understand. We understand. We, understand. we get it. We get it, Jesse. You got you to gotta play the role. We oh, I know what I want to ask about the yeah. Jew thing. Hold okay, on hold one on. minute. Muted, Just one mic. question from me. I haven't yeah. had a chance to really ask questions. Yeah, hold on one second. Hold if on. if Jesse, the real Jesse, Jews are Jesse. not the real Jesse. Jews. Jesse. Just hold on one second. One second. One second. Just are you asking me to hold on? Yes. Yeah, just one, one second. Oh, okay. Go ahead. Read that real quick. Psalms chapter 139, verse 21. Do not I hate them, O Lord, that hate thee? So, God says... Don't, uh, excuse me, David said, don't I hate those that hate God? Go ahead. And am not I grieved with those that rise up against thee? Because there are those who rise up to speak blasphemies against God. We just read it in Revelation. Right. Posing as the real Jews, God says, listen, if you're not supposed to have an affinity with those nations who have stolen your identity, today... If someone steals your identity, do you show up at the police station and have a hug fest with them? No. Nope. No, you don't. Continue to read. I hate them with perfect hatred. Why? Because it's righteous. It's godly. Go ahead. I count them mine enemies. That's what God says. So what we think is the, the black man has to hug and love everybody. So out of Jesse's own words, over time, we've gotten worse. And how have we done that? By trying to assimilate and be a part in this love fest with everybody like it's damn Woodstock. <laughs> Say Woodstock to love everybody when our people are being trotted down more than anybody else. Our people need the attention. That's our right. people need the love. Our people need the upliftment. And that's who the hell we going to give it to. No, no, it is. We don't give a damn about no so, other nations, Hey, hey, notice. Just let me ask, ask a question. May I ask a love, question now? we love our own people. He ain't ask us that. He ain't ask let us me ask, if we love may our own ask people. a question? Go ahead, that's your so question. if the real Jews are not the real Jews, but you guys are real Jews, why are the real Jews doing better than the fake Jews? Oh, that's a and, good and question. Guess what? Good question. It's all written in the Bible you don't believe in. That's it. The answer why are the are real right? Jews doing better than you guys? Okay. So can their children, their children, their children doing better. 28, you guys are begging 43. and blaming. They're living a life. Okay, we're going to answer the question. Deuteronomy chapter 28, verse 43. Deuteronomy. God chapter. explains everything, but you're too blind to see it. Isn't that what he said? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. That is, right? Amazing. Go ahead. Deuteronomy. No, Jesse's, Jesse's, <laughs> too, Jesse's too white to see it. Right. Yeah. <laughs> hey, hey, the shirt fits you well, too. <laughs> red. Deuteronomy, Deuteronomy chapter 28, Jesse. verse 43. Go ahead. The stranger <laughs> that is within thee uh -huh. shall get up above thee very high. So the children of Israel in the wilderness, Moses has given them the law, statutes, and commandments, and the penalties the punishments for breaking those laws what, or curses. What we're reading is one of those curses. The children of Israel broke the laws of God, so therefore this curse fell upon them. Read it from the top again. The stranger. The nations that, is, that were around about us. Go ahead. That is within thee uh -huh. shall get up above thee very high. Go ahead. And thou shalt come down very low. So there's a penalty for us breaking the commandments of God. The lowest state that we are in is a direct reflection or a punishment for what we did in the transgressing of God's laws. And the nation got ex the nations got exalted over us. That's Bible. Mm -hmm. But you don't believe it. But you don't Bible. believe but you don't it. believe the Bible, though. So, so you ask the question, right. how were they doing better than us? God has it explained already, written as prophecy many, many years ago. What, do, it was what does it feel like? What does it feel like? What is it like? What does it feel like as grown men sitting back and pointing the fame? fingers and begging and blaming and all you're doing is sitting back pointing the finger at someone else but you're not free you're not building you're not making things better you're not doing hey, anything you know what's crazy? How, how as you know men that? i can understand women being that way 
as men, you know what's funny? What is it like to sit back and just read the Bible and quote the scripture and blame someone? Hey, what is that like? You know what's funny? Actually, the whole first hour of the show, we were talking about yeah. ourselves, how we ain't right. Exactly. Mm-hmm. So, for so where will y'all saying, get right then? How long is it going to take before uh, you become uh, right? Jesse, Jesse, I don't know. You what, claim to have the word. I'm going to answer your but question. But why? Can when, how answer, long is it going to take before answer, you become right? Can I answer your can question? Can someone answer that? Can I answer your question? I yes, don't know. Sir. I don't know what do you think you know about us, but if you had do your homework, if you had do your research about us, mm. Israel United in Christ, you would have never asked that question because we are we are one of those uh, group that organize organization 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 that actually doing something to build families mm. to build the black man. But you know what, Deke? He, even if he did do the research, he probably wouldn't. No. He wouldn't even give no. it. No. Really, he rejected you, like he just rejected that last verse. Yes. Right. Like, like, that just happened. Yes. Like, it didn't happen. <laughs> right. <laughs> right, dude. Jesse, right. you don't do the research about us because you're white. If you are a black man. <laughs> no, he's red. You're he's the, red. You're red. If you, do, if you was a black man, you would have done the research. You would have known we, we're trying to get the black men better. But since but you're not, you can't since, get the black man better, you're not black, really better. Since you're not black, you actually don't count. You can't get the black man better. You're not better. How can you help yes. someone else when oh. you oh. when hey. you lost yep. yourself? You, you, ever, yes, you ever heard of step and fetch? Right. Step and fetch. He won't get right. Mm-hmm. He's okay with being uh, the, the, a bootlicker to his master. Mm-hmm. Somebody got to be the bootlicker, and that's what I'm looking at. To, oh, look, Don, you're a little controversial. You you're talking the about illegal immigration. I said hey, it's hey. illegal. Hey, Jesse, I got I got one last question for you. Yes, sir. Then I got to run. Okay, no problem. Yeah, are, please, are, you, please. are you so cool? I'm not running. I have my church yeah. service coming up. So I'm supposed to be on oh, the oh, You go to church. I'm running in that. I'm not running from you guys. Hey, I'm yeah, running in that. I got you, I got you Jesse. Hey, yeah, are you, are you, you have church service. So it's only for an hour. Okay. Are you so cool African? Two people know how. Are you African American? Hold exactly. on. Did you say his daddy's white? Ask me what color is Hey, daddy. what color is your daddy? My daddy is black as an ace of space, but he did. But he did. <laughs> hey, hey, you are uh, African American, so cool. You, you so cool, African American, Jesse. Oh my no. lord, huh? No, I am not African American. I am one hundred percent American. White. I don't have a fro. I don't have an afro. Yeah, he's I have an Amerifro. There are no African dogs beating in my chest. The American good time playing in my heart. Black. American guitar. Born on a race on a patient. Black as an ace of space, but 100% American. Ooh. Thank God. Hey, but, I, and red on the inside. I got no, s- white on the inside, black on the outside. Yeah, Jesse, red on the inside. I know, yeah, Jesse, yeah, I know you got to run. I know you got to go. Yeah. But well, you, listen, you, let me you, say this you, in closing. You have it was to come back absolutely to this show, fun man. to be on with you guys. Yeah. I'll be happy to come back. If yeah, yes, yes. yes. You, was, you have to come back, man. It was, because, very, uh, it was very entertaining. Yes. Having and let me on, say this. Man. Let me it say was. this. Uh-huh. I want people to go to jessaleepeterson.com. Uh-huh. jessaleepeterson.com. Or um, what's the other one, Chris? <laughs> Rebuilding <laughs> the Man. Rebuildingtheman.com. <laughs> Rebuildingtheman.com. And check us out. Damn. See what we're doing. And I really, really appreciate you All guys right, having right. me on. I'll be happy to come back whenever. All right. All right. Jesse, for you, hey, Jesse, hey, Jesse, for you viewers, I need everybody to go to israelunite.org. Israelunite.org. Right. Israelunite.org. Come learn the truth. Come learn the truth. That's right. Hey, do not believe what Jesse said. Jesse's telling you a lie. <laughs> come learn the truth from <laughs> us. That's right. <laughs> Jesse and his right. own thoughts. All right, Jesse. Thank hey, you. Thank let's you. Thank 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 you guys. Hey, I want y'all to imagine this. Jesse Lee Peterson right Delicious. now is getting ready to teach people what's in his heart. <laughs> oh, I want y'all to really think about this, how destroyed we are. And guess what? He's gonna have a group, he's gonna have a couple hundred people in his building Maybe thousands. Thousands. listening to him right now and believing every word he says. That's some scary stuff, y'all. Yo. Christianity Damn. is a hell of a drug. Hey, the Bishop Yawasak. Bishop Yawasak was so correct yesterday when he said, "There's nothing, more, there's no crack on the planet Earth more potent than the Christianity." Christianity. Yep. There's never been a rock more potent hey. that's been smoked. You, you know, hey. more than Christianity. You know what's funny? 
Jesse Whoa. Jesse Lee has his job to do to deceive the elect. Right. Mm -hmm. But it's the people that don't hold him to the standard yeah. of the Bible. Bang. Right. So you're in a church where the foundation, of course, is God, Christ, and the words written in the account, testimonies, and the words written by God and Christ, right? Mm. How do you not hold him accountable right. for not using the word of God? Right. And then openly right, right, saying right. he doesn't believe the word of God. Right. He right. openly said it. Right. But, but Cap, oh my Lord. look at what our forefathers did compared to what our people do in the Christian church now. Acts 17 and 10. Real quick. Oh, and yeah, then yeah, we yeah. Can yep. Talk to Deacon. Yep. Yep. Hey, our can people. I will people. Yes. Yes. <laughs> I already know, D. Yeah. Yeah. D was holding it, holding it in, man. Listen, I gotta go. I gotta do my show. I'm heading to the school now. So you guys, and I can stop my show, but I'm not sure if I can do my show at this point. I feel, I feel like I'm telling you, I've lost about fifty percent of intelligence. Yeah. Yeah. Listen to that. Oh, if, the, if my show goes bad, I, I blame y'all for this. That's a high level of stupidity. That yeah, <laughs> it's sad, it's man. Bad. It's sad. Yeah. It's All right, man. D. Hey, D. Thank you for coming. Yeah, hey, safe travels. Shalom, shalom, D. Shalom, D. Shalom, D. Christ bless. Christ bless. Yeah. Yeah. People, don't forget. Don't forget. Yeah. Deacon Anthony's coming up next. So right, right, right. Shalom, yeah, yeah, yeah. D. Hey, 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 Deacon Abiel. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. What sayest What sayest thou, sir? Listen, bro. <laughs> of coonery that that man had to obtain to to get his audience, man. Yeah. We talk, yeah. About, they, they always talk about selling out, selling out. Mm. This man had to completely sell out his people yeah. so that he could his platform. And again, it's for views. You know what I'm saying? It's for right. for right. the money. Right. And it's bad. Even though, like I said, he, who knows if he really believes this stuff that's going on in his mind? He knows what he did. And he knows what he's saying. He right. open speaks against the Bible. Notice every time we went to a scripture, he pretend like it didn't just happen. Right. right. He pretend like that right. didn't just say what it said. Mm -hmm. And that's the same thing that just you said it perfectly. He is the epitome of Christianity because right. that's exactly what Christians do when we bring right. this Bible out. Right. When they see something they don't like, you see how he even said himself, "I don't understand that." We yes. read Romans nine yep. thirteen. Yep. Uh, what, Plain as I day. don't know what that means. Yep. Cannot compute. Cannot compute. His brain can't handle the Bible. Right, right. And exactly what it talks about in Second Timothy when it says our people would not be able to um, basically stand this word, when they wouldn't be able to endure right. the true gospel. Right, 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 right. Yes. Uncle Ruckus, ain't that something? Uncle Ruckus. In the flesh. In the Damn. Flesh. In the flesh. In the flesh. Hey, hey, hey read, read that real quick. Acts, Acts 17 and 10. Acts chapter 17, verse 10. Read and up. the brethren immediately sent away Paul and Silas by so night. So we're going to read the difference between... Uh, the true believers on Christ right. and Christianity. Go ahead. By night unto Berea, whom coming thither went into the synagogue of the Jews. These were more noble than those in Thessalonica. Read. In that they received the word with all readiness of mind. They received the word with all readiness of mind. Go ahead. And searched the scriptures daily. What did these brothers and sisters do? And searched the scriptures daily. Daily. So they didn't just believe what was coming out of the, the man of God's mouth. They went and verified <laughs> it and made sure it lines up with the with uh, what's written. You understand? That's not <laughs> what's going on in Jesse Lee Peterson's church today. Not at all. Not Stop. at all. He's teaching with no Bible like Joel Osteen right. and like Creflo Dollar. It's the same right. thing. Read on. Whether those things were so. See that our, our brothers and sisters back in the days... They verified the thing. Make sure this thing lines up with, with the word of God. Mm -hmm. Damn. Hey, real wow. quick, if, if I may, Deacon. Mm -hmm. uh, one, last, one last scripture. Micah 2 and 8. The I lesson of tonery, bro. I just want the top part of that mm -hmm. thing right there. Oh, God. Hey, Jesse, Jesse is evidence of a successful campaign against the black man. The yes, white sir. Man. yes, sir. He is evidence right. that it doesn't work, that does destroy our people yes. that that doctrine does destroy our people he's a prime example of, of someone that's completely gone right right right, right. right. damn okay Micah 2 and 8 mm -hmm. Micah chapter 2 verse 8 <laughs> even of late my people is risen up as an enemy that's it right there just yep. exactly what you said Deacon Abiel this dude does not give a damn about his people and that should show you brothers and sisters online that not everybody that has the same melanin tone is for you. Right, right, right. right. He's Don't probably the taskmaster. He is the, he's the major taskmaster. Mm -hmm. 
he is the major taskmaster. He don't give a damn. It's about the dollar bill and supporting his white god. And, and, and like I said, I, just just to see him look off screen and was right. laughing like, right. yeah, that was good, right? Yeah, yeah. Right. It, like it's all it's yes. all for clickbait because somebody's gonna make a a, 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 a gif out of it, a gif or gif, mm-hmm. whatever it is. Somebody's going to make a, a, a snippet, put it on, put it on uh, social media, mm-hmm. Jesse Lee and IUIC or whatever the case may be. That's we, we know, we know it. We know right, it's right, going right. to generate revenue and and no and pop and notoriety, gain them right, more notoriety. Right. But ultimately, it was the work of the Lord that right. some of your audience that might have never been exposed to the truth now is going to question everything that messy jesse is teaching he the real messy jesse yes yeah that messy jesse is teaching and then guess what the website was given at the end right yeah the Lord's work was will. done most, hey, most, most size size word don't, his word right. don't go out void so just going right. to, to what you said captain shamaya mm-hmm. real quick get that in psalm 7 11. After that, give me first mark of his 11, verse 21. <laughs> you should call that one. When I say we had so many scriptures lined up, like, Man. Oh, yeah. I was oh, waiting yeah. out to take the gloves air. off. Look, like. I'm over here fighting the air like, like, like Florida yeah, Evans. Yeah, damn, 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 damn. 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 Break, break the bowl, the punch bowl, I'm and everything. <laughs> Let's get that. Psalm chapter 7, verse 11. Uh-huh. God judges the righteous. So it says that the Most High God, the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, judges the righteous. Mm. Read. And God is angry with the wicked every day. Every but Messy day. Jesse said he don't. The Lord don't get angry. Mad. The, Lord, mm-hmm. the Lord don't get angry. Every day. Hey, the Bible has everything covered. Right. And this yep. is for you listeners that actually, this may be your first time watching PSR. You may be a follower of Messy Jess- Jesse. Mm-hmm. Or whatever right. his name Messi is. Messi Jetski. Mess, Messi right. Jetski. Jet-ski. Hey, and, and by the way, <laughs> and by the way, it's, it's nothing wrong with being angry. angry. Nope. Right. You understand? Yeah. Because guess what? You should be angry at the condition right. that our people are. When yep. we step outside right. and we see our people on drugs, right. single family homes and things of that nature, right. us killing each other every damn night. Right. You yeah. should be angry because hey. we're the ones doing it to each other. Yeah. Right. If you notice, when they started pushing that love, love, love and not be angry, mm-hmm. right? is when the rise in our sons being homosexuals happened. Mm -hmm. It was all a transition. The brother that was mad that would teach their sons about oppression has now turned it to a love doctrine and now that same boy who has a love doctrine growing up now feel that love is love. Right. And he also right. has no idea of who he up against. Exactly. He don't right, know who the right, enemy right. is. Right. He has no clue whatsoever. So read Ephesians 4 and 26 again. Mm-hmm. We, read, we read it earlier. We're going to touch it again. Mm-hmm. Because yeah, we, we got to try to get Candace Owen next. <laughs> Candace Owen? Oh, and, damn. And how about Condoleezza Rice, too? Condoleezza Rice, Candace Owen, that's what we're going to try to get. <laughs> I'm, I'm a Rosa. I'm a Rosa. We got to get I'm a Rosa. We got to get She's the original Candace Owen. Oh, y'all hey, celebrities. We got to we gotta get all the B list celebrities. They might show up. <laughs> yep. A list ain't showing up. Get some B list celebrities. Get yep. a list. Hey, Sister Lee, get a list of them. Go ahead, go ahead. Read that again. Ephesians chapter 4, verse 26. Be ye angry. And sin not. That's what God says. He says, so you can be angry, but make sure you don't sin. Go ahead. Let not the sun go down upon your wrath. So, there was, and there was, there, was, there was one more that I wanted. I'm sorry. One more. Real quick. We'll read it quick. Isaiah 30 and 30. We'll read it real quick. So, it says, be ye angry and sin not. So, you can be angry. Angry. You're supposed to be angry. You're supposed hey, to be. Oh, you're at the bottom of society. You're supposed to be upset. And Jonah, yeah. the Lord told Jonah, you do as well to be angry yeah. when he saw what was going on. Yeah. Hey, you do well right. to be angry. Hey, but this, I'm sorry. This is the thing, Cap. Don't forget. This man does not give a damn about the Lord. Right, right. He does he not give care. a damn. He doesn't care. So you have brothers and sisters be like, why aren't y'all? And it's like, he, whatever you bring forth from the Bible, yeah. he's not going to take it's in. Not gonna right. so not gonna he's not going to compute. So when you see uh, our, our, our spiritual, our, our deacons here, you see them not responding. It's actually. Hey, <laughs> af- after we read two scriptures, he's Man, called Bible thumpers. That's it. Yeah. So Bible me- thumpers. Me- meaning he didn't right. want to hear anything the Period. word of God nope. said. He didn't want to hear nothing. Hey, hey real, real talk. Oh, good. Have you ever, <laughs> any, any of the little interviews you ever watched, have you ever seen Jesse say, I got to go? No, no, no. 
Never. Never. <clears throat> Never. The scripture's cut, <clears throat> bro. Never. The wicked flee, D. That's right. it. Right. Yeah, no yeah. Man the wicked flee, but no man pursue it. The scripture's cut. Hey, right. y'all. Hey, I got to get to work, man. I got I got some stuff here I got to get taken care of. Man, you ain't got no damn job. Man, you ain't got no damn job. I know. I said I wouldn't come on no more. I thought you don't have a job. Huh? Damn. I thought you didn't have a job. Damn. Man, I got three jobs, man. Watch me now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we have three jobs, Benji. <laughs> All right, D. Hey, thank, thank you for calling in, man. Thank All you for calling in. Most like Christ bless you, sir. Thank you for the support, Most Budger. Most like Christ bless you, sir.